Hey guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again. CodingPhase.com. Are you tired of using Font Awesome and using basically the same icons that everybody else has? Well, now I'm gonna give you seven different libraries, I mean, pretty much repos that you can get free icons from. All right, stay tuned. Check this video out. All right, guys. So let's get to it. So the first one we got here is called Open Iconic. Okay, so this is a pretty cool uh, icons right here, right? Pretty cool library of icons, right? A cool set of icons, right? Whatever you want to call it. <laughs> some people call it a library. Some people call it a set. Some people call it a curated uh, <laughs> group of icons, you know, custom icons, right? SETI icons. <laughs> <laughs> people call it a whole bunch of different things uh but yeah it seems like a, a very cool uh set of icons right uh i like it it's nice right not my favorite but hey it's open source so you can definitely use it with any of your projects so we can't complain right anything that's free hey who am i to disagree and and try to complain about it right so <laughs> it is what it is guys um let's see what's the next one we have animated icons now this is more like a library okay it has like a, a couple of icons that just animate okay so for example you got this as you can see you have the animation it gets the check and then it removes the kit the check and if you click on it it also keeps it all right same thing as here for the mic you say hey i want to turn it off or let's say for the th oh, the thunder i can say hey i don't want the little thunder etc uh, for this if you lose service okay you can have it like that uh they have another one which is like the little switcheroo right do it like that okay there's another one to show do you want it horizontal or vertical all right it's a cool animation then you have the the volume do you want your volume up do you want your volume down do you want to mute <laughs> right so it's pretty interesting it's pretty cool right this one is for twitter if you want to share it to Twitter, right? This was the same thing for Facebook. This one is for YouTube. Hey, do you want to subscribe to my channel? This one I really like a lot, right? I might use it in the future. Okay, then you have the little, hey, do you want this to go up or do you want this to go down? Okay, you could do it like that or you could do it like that. Okay, it seems pretty cool. All right, do you want to view it? Do you not want to view it, right? You want to keep it like that? click it again and it opens it nice right this one's called uh animated icons by icons 8.com okay it's it's open source you can also use this then from there we have another one which is called feather icons this one are very clean i've seen some people use this one um definitely i think they're more cleaner than what fun awesome has for sure I like the style is like the rounded edges, you know, every icon, it seems like they put in time into it to really build it and design it. So it's pretty cool, right? It's a very good alternative to font. Awesome. Okay. So definitely check them out. Okay. Now, like I said, this one is actually like all SVGs. It's up to you if you want to do it like that. Some people, they like to have it with CSS better instead of dealing with SVGs. But hey, with SVGs, you could have more control. So definitely check them out. Feather icons. Hey guys, this video is brought to you by CodingPhase.com. Make sure you subscribe, make sure you like this video and go check out the links in the description. You're gonna find a lot of good resources there. And if you go visit CodingPhase.com, you're gonna learn how to code and learn how to get a job asap right that's what we specialize in we try to get you prepared to become a developer as soon as possible and if you're interested in that check out the website man the next one that we have here is called bite size icons okay this has pretty much all the things that um you know font awesome has and even more because you have the thing you have the squares right you have the full icon set all right you want it thick you could get it thick you know some people that like it thick i'll leave it to you to use your imagination if you like it thick okay but uh yeah it's 
pretty cool right now another one here some people have used this before which is material design icons these are the ones that most people use when they use on material design let me see if we can find a little something for you guys i mean they're pretty to me i, I think they're pretty dull right like i don't know to be honest with you this is like one of my least favorites okay um i think material design is not good at all it's very plain but some people they like that that look okay so you could definitely use this all right now the next one that we have here is eva icons this i think between this one and the next one i think these are my two favorite ones right the designs are really really good okay look how beautiful this looks like this is nice you got the pngs you got the svgs like it's legit like this is so much better than the ones that font awesome has like look this is the little house this is the image all right look at the little plane okay the outline of like the options is legit and you can also choose the, the ones that are filled up so you can say hey let me get the ones filled up and this is how it looks okay pretty legit right font awesome for whatever reason they're trying to charge everybody now i think after font awesome 5 they got that premium which kind of sucks because a lot of people paid for them to actually create the font awesome like people donated a whole bunch of money and then everybody thought that that was going to be free but <laughs> what they did was they kept the money that everybody paid right and the people that paid they they got the premium one but everybody else don't get the premium right and in open source if you donate to something it's like you're expecting like hey man i'm donating so basically everybody else could also have this you know it's, it's open source and everybody can have it uh what well, oh, was it fun awesome what they did was just keep the money gave it to the people so pretty much sold them the icons and it's like to me personally i don't think that makes sense right but it is what it is font awesome you know it's a effed up business um but it is what it is some people like it and they're used to it and i've actually used it for my websites or for my courses so personally I, that's just one of the reasons why i'm making this video is because i want to show different icons and like really i don't want to be supporting font font awesome no more okay i'd rather support somebody else okay uh then we have teamify okay so teamify has the teamify icons these are very very legit like i really like this look of thin icons because it just makes it look nice and clean and to be honest with you like it's just beautiful <laughs> right so i think a lot of you guys might find this one even better than what font awesome has and you know i don't want to say i want to talk bad about font awesome but i just think like there's so many better options out there okay so definitely check these guys out at themify icons and yeah man this is pretty much the list right so we have the first one which was open uh, iconic icons we had the animated icons from icons8.com we had the feather icons uh, we had the bite size we had the material icons we had eva icons and we had the teamify icons okay definitely check this out i'm gonna put the links in the description so you guys can take a look and see which ones you guys actually like all right so i'm gonna see you guys in the next video mate make sure you subscribe make sure you like this video and please support the channel by either subscribing to uh, the patreon or subscribing to the website it's all in the description and yeah i'll see you guys later bye